Hey guys, welcome back to the EA Sports FC 24 Arsenal career mode and I took a day off yesterday first time in a while but I feel like I need a break from me so I'm back fresh and ready to go again I mean I kind of forgot where we left off last uh, last episode I believe we lost in the uh, RB Leipzig first leg uh, two goes down which is again not a uh, not an ideal situation because our goal is to pretty much it's to uh, you know win the treble, but feels like Champions League might be on the line. Even in the Premier League, it might be on the line as well. So today, four games as usual: Leeds United away, and then Le RB Leipzig away, and then South South Castle <laughs> Southampton uh, on the uh, neutral cup. What neutral cup? I'm talking about FA Cup semi-final in the Wembley Stadium and also Brighton away next episode will be a big one as well depends if we are able to qualify for the semi-final but I do not want to jinx it so uh, we still have a few more games to go before the end of the season and I feel like we really do have to start getting our shit together because I really want to do a um, a a treble again to uh, you know to say goodbye to this series because oh my god look at this yes I forgot about this Jude Bellingham is pretty much done for the season so to replace him Smith Rowe would be in terms of like would be good to be in that position but Ramsdale fitness issue has been quite terrifying not gonna lie so Ryu will be getting a start i need to fix that with ramsdale uh fitness in a bit uh so i think this game against leeds united they just got promoted this season so let's go ahead and go for this game i didn't quite properly show you guys you know who's starting today but you know if you guys pause for the uh, previous scene you guys probably know who's starting who's not and I should have probably put Saliba back in, especially he came back uh, from an injury, uh, which also gives him, you know, ha he has to build a bit of fitness here. Oh, beautiful ball to Martinelli. Cuts it inside. Go for it. Oh, what a great finish as well. But that pass from Declan Rice was so good to the point where Martinelli's goal even looks sweeter than that. It was a good opening. And hopefully we're going to score a few more goals. And then we can start making some subs. Even though it's only 11 minutes in. Oh, beautiful ball by Odegaard. Here comes Smith Rowe running on the left channel here. If nobody tries to go for it, he has to go for himself. Straight at Millier. That was a poor, that was a poor, poor finish by Smith Rowe. Should have done a little bit better here. Oh, but what a tackle by Flavich. Go on. Oh, to, to Martinelli. Damn it. Corner kick coming in. Odegaard's taking it to Gabriel. Couldn't really get the clear of it. Ben White retrieving the ball. Odegaard. Oh, we just need a good cross. Another corner kick here. Odegaard's taking this one as well. Whips it in to Gabriel. Heads it away to Torres outside the box. Good turn by Martinelli. Keep on going. And it is going to be another corner kick. All right, here's Martinelli. Beast himself cuts it in the middle, finding Flavich here. He has to go for his own. Come on, Flavich. Oh, it makes it very easy for us. 2 nothing. right before, two minutes right before halftime. I mean, certainly it is the lead that we're looking for. It is the goal we're looking for, but we just need one more goal. I realize we're playing against RB Life Station the next game, so. Which means we have to rest the player uh, when score looks good. Here comes Silva driving down the right-hand side, but gives the ball away to Ginotto. And that's a foul by Declan Rice, but it's played on. The Ginotto again on the left here. We are looking for the third goal, trying to kill the game as soon as possible, but we just couldn't really retain the possession. Oh, beautiful ball to Torres. Come on. Go on, Smithrow. Make that run in the middle. He stopped. Oh, but it doesn't matter. Martinelli is there. I'm sure the pass was intended. To go to Smith row, but you know what doesn't matter. Martinelli is on the end side to score the winner. And we're three goals up, which means that it's a perfect opportunity to make some changes here. Uh, Basuma coming on. Verts coming on as well. Who else? I think Neto coming on. Martial coming on the left. And oh, I think the back four looks, looks good. I mean, fitness-wise, they're still looking very healthy. Right now, we just hope that nobody's going to go 
go go down injured or anything. Oh, that was a beautiful ball. Oh my god, good save by Raya. He hasn't played a lot to be honest, Raya, but you know what? Finally, he has given a chance in the Premier League. First time this season so far for him, and he made a good save. And here comes a counterattack. I don't know why Silva is there, but certainly he has the pace to do so. Whips it in in the middle. Not a bad cross, but right back to Verts. Here comes Declan Rice. And and here comes Basuma. Couldn't get the ball out. Martial getting the ball back. Seven more minutes to go. Finding Sinchenko overlapping run. Right now, we just need somebody in the middle, but it was cleared away. Ten more seconds to go and call it. I believe we are currently... Uh, we might be at the top of the league table right now, but you know what? Let me shut up and defend this play here. Should be, yeah, that should be it. 3-0, it was a rather a comfortable win for a while. I feel like for the past few episodes, the game that we played was was tough. I don't think we had a convincing, a convincing win except the Chelsea game away in the FA Cup. Other than that, we are... Looking pretty good in today's game. Hopefully building that momentum into the next game as well. And there you go. Spurs and City. They drew. Which means they drop points again. I believe they dropped points against Bournemouth in the last game. Which means we are at the top of the league table, I think. So yeah, there it is. So we're currently at the top of the league table. Sharing points with Man City with 75 points. Which means in the next game, whether we... Uh, draw or win against Brighton we are going to be going back to the top with maybe one point or three points clear it really depends but I think this is not that is not the biggest topic but this right here is the biggest topic here uh, Champions League quarterfinal I mean Man City is having a howler we are having a howler as well but that one goal that we that that goal we scored in the uh, the home fixtures, I hope in a way it kind of keep our hope alive, but certainly didn't quite help, especially conceding another last minute goal. Uh, PSG looking like might be going to the final, but all oh, the other game by Munich and Barcelona, it's a tough game, one one. So traveling to the next game against RB Leipzig, you know what the game against Southampton? I know I can play the kids, I believe in them, but right now it's all about the RB Leipzig game. So here we go, guys. This is the starting lineup. Go big or go home episode. That type of game. Ramsell and go. Tommy Asso on the left back. Gabriel Saliba. Ben White in the middle. We have Rice, Smith, Rowe, Odegaard. Front three. Martinelli, Jesus, and Torres. Actually, I'm going to put on Neto in this game. Because I feel like Torres and Vlavic are very good coming off the bench. So let's set the tone right. And this is pretty much the biggest game of the season because right now we are, the game is on the line. Everything is on the line and the treble is on the line. But right now it's all about trying to beat RB Leipzig, hopefully by two goals or even go into penalty. It doesn't matter as long we have to hope to uh, to keep us in the competition and keep the, uh, the treble alive. So uh, the stadium looks pretty good to be honest. I'm not sure if this is the official... Stadium for RB Leipzig, but right now it's all about the focus here. Corner kick swings it in, but it was not quite headed away. Oh, please don't let him score. Oh, good defending by Ben. Here comes Tom Yasu now. Here comes the counter attack. Smith throw. Not Smith throw. Odegaard to Jesus. Come on. First proper chance here. Five minutes in. Here comes Jesus. Go for it. Oh, good save by the goalkeeper. Damn it. Oh, but we tr retrieved the ball here. Come on, Tommy has to make that overlapping run. Beautiful. Driving down the line here. It's being taken out. It's a court. Oh, it's a penalty. Oh, my God. Danny Almo, the the Spanish international, has taken uh, has taken Tommy Yasu out in the box. It was kind of a late fall there by Tommy Yasu. But you know what? I think it would have still been a penalty. But here comes Jesus. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, let me shut up for a second and make sure that I'll score this one. Oh my god, holy crap. The goalkeeper gets the right way. But Gabriel Jesus has pulled the string together. And our title, not title dream, our semi-final or quarter-final dream is still alive. I don't know what I'm talking about, but that was a good, good penalty right there. I mean, the goalkeeper gets the right way. But Jesus 
helped us to get one back. That was a very good penalty as well. There's so much power behind it. Right now, the hope is alive. Oh, no. Here comes RB Leipzig. Oh, good defending. Good tackle. Good save by Ramsdale. There's no tackle whatsoever. But that was a good tackle right there. Oh, my God. Oh, Ramsdale, another good save as well. Thank God. Defensively, it has been very, very poor in those areas. 31 minutes in. After scoring the first goal, we have been relatively quite quiet. We just can't really break the deadlock at the moment. Oh, beautiful. It was Martinelli on the left here. Oh, we don't have anybody in the middle. To Smithrow, to Odegaard. Back to Smithrow. Go for it. Oh, it was blocked as well. Oh, my God. Imagine that would have gone in. One last chance here. Oh, no. Good tackle. Good tackle. Holy crap. Gabriel with the biggest tackle of the game right there. Biggest tackle of the night. Which kept us in the game still. I mean, this game has been very stressful. But we still have 45 minutes to save our treble. Oh, good tackle by Smith Rowe. Here comes Jesus again. But nobody's supporting him. That's fine. As long as we keep the ball. Tommy Yasu making that run. The Smith Rowe. Good turn. Finding Odegaard here. Go for it. Good save by the goalkeeper once again. This guy has been a total nightmare every time we play against him. I think it's time to make some changes here. I mean, I'm not against anybody here, but we just need a little bit of variation in the team. So three changes coming on. Uh, Torres, Flavich, and also Verts coming on. Very attacking mind at the moment. Nobody, nobody has done nothing wrong at the moment, but it's just that I really do need to find that winner. To Vert, turn. To Declan Rice. To Torres. Good turn. Go for it. Oh, good save again by the goalkeeper. Oh, I've been giving him too much compliment here. I don't certainly don't want to do that. And I certainly don't want to have Flavic on the corner here. Martinelli. I mean, Odegaard's taking it. Oh, get there. No. The scramble. No. How did he miss that? How the hell did Gabriel miss that? Win, win that, win that back. No, guys, that was the chance there. That was the proper chance. Uh, to Torres here. Go on. Steps it back. Flavich in the middle. Go for it, Rice. Oh, my God. Imagine that falls to Martinelli. We still have 18 more minutes to go. 18. We just need to find an equalizer. We just need to find the second goal. Whips it in. Oh, why is Odegaard even there? To Flavic. To Vert. Oh, my God. He was aiming for the bottom right corner. How close was that? It has to be very close. Oh, my God. It's just an inch off. It was just an inch off. Five more minutes to go, guys. Five more minutes. We need to look for that second go here. We are running out of time. Flavic to Odegaard. Damn it. Damn it. Torres again. Back to Ben. Literally last part of the minute here. To Tomiyasu. Oh no, okay. Tomiyasu had to whip it across in the middle to Torres. Oh no. To Martinelli. Oh my god! Oh, goalkeeper, you gotta be shitting me, man. You have to be shitting me, goalkeeper. I just can't break through this keeper at all. Look at that save. What am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to win? One last chance here. I'm losing hope. I'm losing hope. Oh, get there! Flavich! No! No! Well, we are. We are out. We are out of the freaking quarterfinal of the Champions League. And it's fucking stupid, I'm telling you guys. How the hell. I mean, RB Leipzig had three four shots right the whole time we had at least 10 we keep hitting the goalkeeper putting on good finishes just doesn't work i just we just couldn't win i mean when the goalkeeper is like when the goalkeeper is that good 
How am I supposed to win? How am I supposed to beat them? Well, look at the match facts. Look at that. 13 shots. Pass accuracy. We totally dominated the game throughout the whole time, right? Oh, guys, I'm, I'm actually, re I'm like shaking right now because I don't think we deserve this at all. Well, so both Arsenal and City are out of the quarterfinal of the Champions League. And PSG, Barcelona, they're through. So congrats to them. I guess, you know what, back-to-back -back trouble is not meant to be. But at least we still have two trophies on the line. Southampton in the FA Cup and also the Premier League. And still, uh, Man City as the final, uh, final day of the uh, of the seasons. But you know what? It's all right now. Let's just focus. Let's clear my mind, and just play the game against Southampton and also against the game uh, against Brentford. Not Brentford, Brighton. This is the team I'm going for for the semi final of the FA Cup against Southampton. I mean, uh, we rotate the squad quite heavily here. Orion, Gosinchenko, Kivior, Silva, uh, Timber in the middle where Basuma, Onana, Smith Rowe, front three where Martial, Vlavish, and also Torres. And honestly, I'm still kind of uh, mentally and emotionally, I'm still kind of uh, recovering from, you know, from what happened uh, from that game. It's just absolutely bullshit. Goalkeeper was way too OP. I mean, there's no other way to do it. I mean, there's so many times where I was actually looking for, you know, an open goal because that was pr pretty much the easiest way to score goals, right? I mean, it's an open net anyway. But you know what? Let's kind of shift our focus to uh, to this game here against Southampton. I mean, I mean, it feels like there's only one winner because Southampton, I believe, they're still in the... I think they're still in the championship. I don't think they got promoted this year. But you know what? I, I still don't want to look down on any opposition at all. Oh, that was a good ball by Southampton here. Here comes Stuwa on the right. Uh, there's there's way too many. Oh, good save by Raya. Holy crap. I thought the player was going to square off in the middle because pretty much there are four, two, three to four players in the box free. But thank God he decided to go for a goal, which kind of gave us uh, a, a moment on the line here. Martial losing the ball here. Oh, to Timber. In the middle. To Flavic. Oh, good save by the goalkeeper. How did he even get a hand to it? Corner kick for us. Second one of the day. Torres whips it in. Heads it away. Kind of goalkeeper reclaims it. Oh, here comes a chance for Southampton. Here here's come the number 20. And... Oh, my God. Another good save by Raya. Timber is just not in it so far in this game. 29 minutes to go or 29 minutes in. Heads it out wide to Flavich or Torres. Oh, go on. Come on. He has the pace. I know he can do it. Go drive down on the left-hand side here. Running out of space to Flavic. Oh, good block. Oh, good tackle. Here comes Basuma. Go on, Smith Rowe. Make that run. Beautiful Smith Rowe. Go for it. Oh, good shot. Well, finally, the deadlock has been broken. 41 minutes in. It was a good tackle. Good interception by Basuma, I believe so. But that through ball to Smith Rowe was perfect. And he buries that one in. And we're taking one nothing lead, looking at the replay with his left foot as well. I mean, by the way, in real life, Smith Rowe has picked up an injury, a knee injury. We don't know how long he's going to be out for, but I hope he is going to recover soon because... In real life, I think he's an awesome player. In the game, he is also an awesome player. Oh, uh, what is that sliding tackle by Silva? Kivior in the middle. Oh, another good save. A near post save from Raya. Honestly, we don't deserve this lead at all. The whole time, the entire time, I feel like Southampton are the only team so far in this game where they genuinely have good chances. And... Oh god, what the hell am I even talking about? Why am I even complimenting them? It's right before halftime as well. Oh, I feel like we're not going anywhere with this team so far. So, making three attacking changes here. Uh, Onana coming off for Vert. And also, uh, Jesus coming on. Martinelli coming on. And this is a very dangerous possession. Get it out. Just get it out. Thank god. Oh, good tackle. Torres, go on. Keep on running. Keep on running. Jesus, I see on the far post. 
But you're not making any good run. Oh my god. He is not making himself free in the middle. Oh. Oh my god. Good save by Raya. Thank god I asked him to come out. We still have 20 more minutes to go. We need to look for a winner here. I don't want to go into extra time. Oh my god. Oh, good block. Get it out. Holy crap. Imagine conceding to Southampton in the last minute here. Smith roll. Come on, down the line. To Torres. Go on, Torres. To Jesus. Beautiful. Oh my god. Finally. Finally, finally, finally. Potential winner here. Jesus has scored. But let's talk about that assist from Torres. It was a pinpoint pass and also a pinpoint finish as well. Uh, Benusu, I believe that's the goalkeeper's name, has no chance saving that one. I mean, Jesus was lining that up the whole time. And we did it. 2-1. Actually, we haven't done it yet. I mean, we still have 13 more minutes to go. Anything can happen. Smith Rowe has to come off. Actually... Uh, Basuma will be in the middle. Declan Rice coming on, adding a little bit more defensive capability there. Ben White coming on for Timber. Uh, actually, oh, damn it, I, I, I wish I had Tommy Yasu in that area, but Tommy Yasu is not free today. Not free. He's not fit today. He's not. Of course, he's free. Oh my God! Imagine they score. Holy crap! Literally two more minutes in, with that range of a shot. Oh, Bas uh, Basuma is out. Okay, I want to ask Martinelli to go down the line there. Get it out. Get it out. Martinelli keeps the ball. Oh, to somebody else. To Martinelli. 1-2 with Jesus. No. Oh, my God. Some. Oh. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. No. I refuse to believe it. Oh, beautiful. Just get out. Get out. Get out. Get out of here. We are through to the final, guys. It's a very stressful game, and I'm no, and I know emotionally I'm still kind of you know I'm still damaged from the last game against RB Leipzig because till now I still don't believe we, I still didn't believe that we lost, but doesn't matter we are we, well a double is still on the line here I mean so we still have the league we still have the FA Cup and right now we just need to know who we are playing against in the final. Okay, we are playing against Aston Villa. In the final of the FA Cup. So, uh, I forgot who they played. Um, I forgot. I totally forgot about that for some reason. So, they played... Oh, what am I even doing? <laughs> what am I doing? So, they beat Coventry uh, City 3-2. So, it was a tight score. Which means that there are some defensive vulnerability of the team. So, right now, uh, let's talk about the last game right here. Uh, Brighton away. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people are quite. Uh, a lot of people are kind of afraid going to Brighton or going to American Express Stadium because you know what? There's always a beating. Doesn't matter because all we have to do is to win this game. Uh, we still level on point with Man City, so we just have to win this game. It's that easy. Everybody is fit, which is I love to see that. To be honest, so. It's a must-win game. I'm still gonna put Smith Road there, and yeah, I don't don't think I need to make much alteration. Yeah, that's it. The the basic uh, starting eleven, the default starting eleven, I would say. Oh, good tackle by Smith Road. Go on. We need our first attack, first chance of the game. Vlavic finding oh, Martinelli. That was a good run, but the defender is not gonna get into it. That's fine. Back to Flavic, doesn't matter. Rice, go for it. Oh, good save by the goalkeeper. That was our first proper chance of the night. Martinelli whips it in to Torres, heads it over the bar. Potentially one last chance here. Smith Rowe, go on. That was a beautiful pass. Come on, Smith Rowe. Oh, Martinelli, not Martinelli. Odegaard is there to converse that one in. I know it's just a tap in, but that pass from Vlavic, it's a killer pass to Smith Rowe. Argu arguably, Smith Rowe should have scored uh, first time off, but you know what? Doesn't matter. We take the precious 1 0 lead right before halftime as well. Certainly, what a great way to end the first half. Oh my god. Like, how, how the hell am I supposed Like, what am I supposed to do? The who has scored? I mean, 
you can't really blame you know marking it's been it's not tight or anything but look at it again it was a good finish as well i mean threw everybody pretty much so rice tried to rush out but the hood it was a good finish oh beautiful torres go on oh he has to go by himself oh beautiful right after the kickoff as well i mean let's go everybody i mean 2-1 now the trademark celebration from torres and we have regained control after 90 seconds i believe oh beautiful torres winning the ball back to Flavich, cuts in the middle oh i couldn't really find a good pass to smith row again going outside keeping the ball beautiful whips it in it is going to be a corner kick we look a bit quite boring so far or at least after scoring the second goal um i'm gonna make all five changes here timber coming on basuma verts martial and also neto coming on as well hopefully we're gonna find the third goal and at the same time hopefully we are not going to lose the lead four more minutes here we're still looking for that third goal potentially oh go on ah oh, to basuma that would have been that would have been the uh that would have been a goal i think that would have been a goal if basuma is through last three minutes here oh timber come on that was certainly not the tackle i was looking for oh but that is the tackle i was looking for oh come on one last chance just come and score one more goal for us netto on the right storming on the right side here to martial no <laughs> oh martial i signed him what a few months ago still hasn't scored a goal yet i don't blame him oh that will be the end. Gabriel almost adding the third. But you know what? I'm happy. I'm settled with a W. It doesn't matter what the scoreline was in the end as long as we got the W. So that is it for today's episode. Uh, but we need to look at the, uh, the league table because I believe this might be the game that we're in hand. Which means winning that game put us three points clear of City. And we still have four more minutes to go. No, four more minutes to go. Four more games to go. No and I have to make a decision here, guys. I mean, right now, month of May, we have... Yep, we have five more games to go. Okay. All right, okay. So what I'm going to do is that. Um, uh, let me think how I want to schedule. Oh, no. Look at the manager rating not looking good at all okay so which means if we don't win the final you know you know the two remaining trophies of the season i'm sure i'm sure we're gonna get sacked for sure but look at the manager rating it abysmal so looking at the calendar to uh kind of plan out how we're gonna finish the uh the uh, upcoming episode so i feel like the next episode will be the final one, a final one of the series. It will be a series finale. It is going to be a longer episode because we're going to play, what, I don't know, six games here in total. And in the next episode, you guys will find out whether, uh, you know, we're going to complete a double or we're going to go home with nothing. So we will find out. But that is it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in a bit.